Hi guys! In this video, we're going to be learning how to set up a web forum. A web forum is a form of web community where members can join and post about similar interests. Anyways, go ahead and go to Google in your web browser. Once you're there, type Zeta Boards into your search bar. Hit enter, and the first result that comes up will be www.zetaboards.com. Click there. Zeta Boards is the platform that we'll be using to host our website. Go ahead and click register today. Here you're going to be asked to give a forum name, a username, a password, your email address, and your birthday. You'll also be asked to read the terms of service. It's actually worthwhile to read these terms of service because ZetaBoards reserves the right to shut down your board if you do not obey them. Anyways, um, let's try making a forum about technical writing. For a username, how about a technical writer? And for a password, oh, I'm not going to tell you that one. for an email address, use one that you still have your account information for because you may be asked to validate. Click register and you're going to be brought to your board index. You see your board name right here, your name up here. And you also see a lot of other stuff. This is the default skin for Zeta boards. Uh, you have your administration control panel here, your inbox with a message in it. Um, these are your forum categories as well as your general subforms within them. Anyways, let's go check out that message. This is your welcome message from the Zeta board team. And they're just trying to help you get started out. So let's take their help and go to the administrative control panel. You'll be asked to put in your password again. It's completely safe. You'll, the first time you log into this, you're going to be asked to do your initial board setup. So, default board time zone, your category. Um, whether or not you want to display your board in the directory. Quick board description. as well as some tags that help qualify your form. You, you'll want to think of more tags than that, but in the interest of time, we'll leave it there. Hit Submit. Okay, you should see this notice that your general preferences have been saved, and now you have access to your entire administrative control panel. Over here, you're going to see a lot of different tools. This is your administrative tool belt. We're not going to go over all these different sections, but we will be looking at two in particular. First, we're going to look at themes. Themes allow you to change the overall outlook of your board in case you don't like the default skin. So go ahead and click themes right here. And before we get into this, we're actually going to move to a different website. So, oops, it's a different website. Um, this is Zathyrus Network. The URL is right here. Type that in and scroll down. You'll notice the board looks exactly like yours. You're going to want to go to theme galleries. And uh, we're just going to, you can choose between any of these things, but we're just going to quickly take a recommended light theme. And uh, you can see a little quick preview if you hover over any of the topics. Um, I don't know if any of these are popping out to you. Oh, I like that one. I've cut their green. Okay, so this is called Birds of Paradise. There are usual multiple parts. Here we go. First one is CSS. Or actually, let's do theme layout first. That's the easier one. And this is shorter. Um, ah. Oops. Okay. That's not being very cooperative. But anyways, you copy all the... Oh, it's right there. Jeez, it, You can use this handy-dandy select all feature. Um, anyways, copy all that. Go back over to your skin manager and go to edit theme layout. You'll see right here, this is for theme layout. And replace the code you see right there with the code you found. Okay, now go, go to... Um, scroll back. 
through the other website. And this time you want to take all the CSS. CSS goes into theme appearances. And similarly, you just replace everything with what you found. Um, now we could go through and edit the graphics one by one using edit theme images, but in the interest of time, we will not do that. Anyways, you can click return to board. And look at that. The skin's changed. It looks totally different. Well, not totally different. Um, now if we go back to the administrative control panel, we can create a section. And this is basically how your content is going to be organized. So, since we're a technical writing board, we'll create a technical writing forum. And then you can create a standard forum underneath technical writing by placing the forum in your category. General technical writing, perhaps, would be a basic form to have. OK. Um, you're going to want to make it so people can respond and post threads in these forums. Okay. Once you're done choosing all your settings, you hit create forum. Now if we go to return to board, you can see your new forum. Okay. By now you should be aware of how to set up a forum, design a theme, add content to your forum, and you should even be familiar with this great support network for finding out more tools and resources for improving your Zetaboards forum. Thank you.